What's up guys, this is Travi here again, we are back here on 7 Days to Die. We're actually doing some more of a playthrough. So after my video of showing you guys how to mod stuff, I cleared out the horde that was trying to kill my base. And uh, now we're actually preparing for the horde. So now that I'm more fun, I crafted a bunch of more of our lovely cobblestone cubes. Um, I have about a thousand of them actually. And we're going to go sit here and uh, to build up a little bit of a base here. And I'm also going to put up some walls. So this is just my actual house that's going to be here. And then we're actually going to make an actual walls around this area. Now the one thing is, guys, you got to be careful of. Don't make the area too big, no matter how fun it is, no matter how much you can craft now instantaneously. Don't make it too big because the zombies will start spawning on the horde night. The zombies will physically start spawning into your house. Not fun. So let's get into this and let's start doing some building. some blocks up a little way over there. There is all of our concrete cubes. That's pretty well. So I guess we'll start doing this. Ooh, dang, dude. That's, oh, that's so much more nasty. Look at that. Oh, dang, dude. Look at his brain. His brain's hanging out. That's cool. That'd be a good spot for a door. Right there. Ah, oh, works good enough. It's not only the grinding is the issue, it's the waiting for all the stuff to craft is what takes forever. But yeah, none of that. We don't have to wait for a single thing. So uh yeah. Building to be ready and prepared for all these zom zoms. But I guess let's fix up this roof and let's <laughs> set it on horde nights and for nighttime I don't have the zombies running most of the time I had them on the walk so just so I can get around easier and do stuff well since I'm more toward the like late game era kind of thing and I'm pretty much set up and ready to go let's make the game a little more challenging and uh, make this horde night even more crazy than it's already going to be and we're going to turn the zombies on the run I'm probably going to regret this but let's have some fun I thought you have a real challenge and see if we can survive this. Jog, run. I don't know what nightmare is, and I kind of don't want to know what nightmare is. Actually, you know what? Screw it. We'll put it on nightmare. Let's see what happens if we do nightmare. Let's do nightmare just for the fun of it. Truly, truly terrifying. 
So we're gonna grab all the ammo we can. Um, that SMG that I had, we're gonna use this as a weapon too. Take out anything that's unnecessary inside of our inventory that we do not need. We got nine mil, shotgun, our lovely spear. We have a bunch of repair kits, I'm 60. And uh, we better hope and pray that we survive this. Not my best. Oh, did it. Okay. Don't ask how I did that, but that was some skill. That took some skill right there. So I have to hop top of my new collector and hop up there. Hopefully the zombies don't get that kind of idea. Um, the other thing is I gotta make sure and watch out for my door down there. So I actually, to be fair, what I might do, so this gets zombies don't get in, and I can't get in either. I'm going to put this concrete blocks here, so the zombies have a little bit less of a chance in order to uh, get up here. Cause I, I'm low key kind of scared. Of course it's worse. I have to hide myself in concrete, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I'm going to crap myself. Yeah. Armor wise, we are not doing too well with armor. I still have plant fiber pants. About that. And I got some steel helmets and some, some steel stuff from my bought from the trader. I really should have gotten some more pants and boots. So, not my best decision. Ooh, this is not going to be fun. This is going to be scary as all hell. I wonder how fast these guys go, bro. Am I going to be able to outrun them? Like I said, I move pretty fast, but am I going to be able to outrun that? Level what? 253 so even though it's my first seventh day my first horde night it's gonna be pretty crazy so it's not about the game stage there we go oh my god look at them look at them go bro what Woo. I fell down by accident because it's not really possible to shoot these guys. So I guess we're gonna be on the move. Oh my god, my game is lagging so bad right now. <laughs> my game is lagging so bad. Okay, mind, mind you guys, I didn't even kill a single one yet. Oh shoot, baby. Oh my god, dude, that's all I got. There's no way I can hit them without guns. Oh my god, the reload. Oh no. Dude. Okay, so apparently Nightmare guys, when you try to aim at them, look at that, look at that, they threw away. They turn away from you. So I only outrun them very, very slightly. Very, very slightly. So they can easily still catch up to me. Faster moving. These are the high powered rounds, bro. Dude, I don't dare to hit them with a melee. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, I got my fire. There's so many of them. <laughs> Oh, it's so scary, bro. Okay, we're actually surviving. We're doing, we're doing pretty well. Harry is that what makes you aiming at them? They will literally be out of the way to get out of your way of sight when you're shooting. Very terrifying. Very terrifying. Very. Okay, it's, it's almost like almost suicidal to try to uh, knife these guys. It's doing nothing, man. The shotgun is doing nothing to them. Mind you, this is all my person maxed out, too. It is doing nothing. Ow, that almost, all it takes, this is a call to these zombies, guys. All it takes is to get surrounded and I'm just done for. So 
this is a truly nightmare. Hey, nightmare. Oh. I did not want to eat a barbecue thing right there. Owie. I'm about to get barbecued. Dude, they move so fast. The way. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm bleeding out. Okay. See, this one is freaking worrisome. Chainsaw. It's not even phasing them, man. This SMG is not even phasing them right now. <laughs> oh, doggo! I was poor with Dire Wolf in the midst of this like, zombie war. We hit it. My Call of Duty game, guys. I think I saved him right now. Oh, thank God, bro. The daytime. Now we can finish off these guys. Unbelievably, guys. We went through a lot of ammo. I went through all of my high powered ammo, basically. And uh, yeah, we survived it. Unbelievably, guys, we survived the Horde Night. A nightmare. So, by next Horde Night, guys, I should have a much more actual normal base set up and actual defenses and stuff like that. So, I'm not just sitting there running around in circles like a chicken with my head cut off. Um, we're actually going to have actual electrical stuff, hopefully, some auto turrets, and yeah, the next Horde Night, that was actually relatively mild when it came to zombies. I didn't see a single juggernaut. Um, and there's only some cop zombies and some a bunch of radiated zombies, which I was expecting radiated zombies. Other than that, though, it really wasn't as bad as I thought it would be when it came to the zombie type wise. But running wise, oh yeah. If, it was, if I wasn't on the ground running around in circles, I guarantee you my base would have been torn to shreds with how fast they were going. My only issue was I would have loved to stay on top there, but. My only issue was that the zombies were literally like, like you couldn't shoot them. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, it's been a really, lo I love playing this game so much. If you guys want to see more of this, please let me know in the comments down below. And if any of you guys want to do play with me on any of the games I ever play in stream, please let me know and I can happily invite you. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe guys. And remember to be a tryhard. I'll see you guys later.